Dear student, let us see what is there in this question. Which statement about atomic spectra is not true? So he's talking about the Bohr's model of the atomic structure, which is applicable on hydrogen and uh, like metal, metals like this. So there are shells and electrons are moving up and down. They provide the evidence for discrete energy levels in the atoms. Yes, indeed. No problem at all. Like um, definitely because of this model only from the atomic spectra that we get emission spectra and the absorption spectra. We jump to this conclusion that there must be energy states. Now, emission absorption lines of the equal frequency correspond to the transition between the same two energy level. Absolutely correct. So if you are falling from the third to one, are you going from one to three? The energy will be the same, but the only thing is in one case, it will be absorption spectra. In another case, it will be emission spectra, but the frequency will be same. Energy will be same. Now, see, absorption line arise when electrons gain energy. Absolutely correct. When the electrons gain energy at that time, they jump and they uh, go to the excited state. And that is why absorption spectrum is created. Obviously, the answer is D now. So emission line always correspond to the visible part of the electromagnetic spectrum. No, my dear friend, no, it's not like that. So there is a concept here. So that so in chemistry, might be students have studied that uh, Lyman series, uh, Balmer, Lyman, Balmer, Paschen, Bracket and Fun like that. So <clears throat> what is happening is like, let us say there is energy level one. Uh, just a moment. Uh, this is first energy level, second energy level, third energy level, fourth, fifth, like that. So when somebody is like coming to the first energy level, uh, wherever are, is the electron jumping from, but it is jumping into the first energy level. These are known as Lyman series and the energy produced is UV rays, ultraviolet. Now, when some, some electron is jumping into the uh, second shell, they are producing visible light. This is known as Balmer series and visible light is produced and when the electrons are jumping into the third or into the fourth or fifth or the longer one everywhere now only and only infrared is produced clear so it's just a piece of information which uh, is an additional piece of information for you because uh, IB is asking you questions about visible light might be they would be asking you questions about UVs or infra this is what is happening uh, now I'm going to give you the names also this is known as Lyman series this is known as Balmer Lyman Balmer Passion not actually remembering everything Lyman Balmer Passion bracket fund whatever way you pronounce it. So these are the uh, five uh, uh, series and these are the radiations which are produced in this. So this is how we do this question, my dear student, and answer for our question will be D. So this is Professor Varun. Please subscribe to the YouTube channel. Please join the YouTube channel because you would be getting so many other things. You are going to access the paper two questions and you would be participating in uh, the Kahoot test also if you are a subscriber to the YouTube channel. Okay, then all the best.